we have two uh, two guys from from France now, and uh, I'm from Norway, and the drummer from England. So it's uh, uh. <laughs> pretty much a French <laughs> French band at the moment. <laughs> yeah, it's a good good combination, you know. Um, yeah. And me and Emmanuel, we have been working together for so many years uh, since 2003. Yeah. Um, when she was uh, recording with um, with the choir, so we have been working together together ever since uh, 2003. And um, Niels has also been in the band for quite some years now. And uh, yeah, I think that we have a really really strong and, and professional lineup. And uh, you know. It, we're also great friends, all of us. It's a really good climate in the band, so we always look forward to to go on tour, you know, so we can uh, spend time with each other and uh, have that social thing on on the road as well. In addition to to doing uh, great shows as well. Yeah, uh, Martin um, Emmanuel, you you really uh, changed her uh, the course of her career because uh, she was destined to to sing opera. Uh, she's a metal soprano, uh, and now uh, she's a metal singer. <laughs> yeah, actually, she's doing both. Um, so she's still working in the uh, with the opera in between. Yeah. And uh, so she's a um, part-time opera singer and part-time uh, metal singer. So I think that's a great, great variation in her in her line of work. You know, it's uh, two completely different worlds. You know, the going on tour with a metal band and and singing in the operas so yeah she she definitely have um, um some really nice variation in her work i think yeah um question i have to, to to ask you when you when you compose an album and you get a very brilliant singer like uh, emmanuel um do you compose the the melody and um, the the singing part uh, knowing that she can do everything yeah, I mean, uh, that's like the privilege I have now with with Emmanuel in in the band is that I can pretty much compose whatever I want and she'll be able to sing it. Um, and you know, we also been working together for for so many years now that I I, I know her voice really well and uh, about her singing qualities and she has a lot of them. So I feel like I have really. Um, free hands you know uh, it's uh, I think every composer's dream you know uh, to have that freedom to to go in whatever direction uh, that I want with uh, with each and every song and it's fantastic and I mean the the musical concept of Serenia has always been about that kind of diversity you know uh, uh, basically we're a, a mix of a rock and a metal band but we all always you know try to implement elements from all kinds of musical genres you know classical uh, goth rock um, um, uh, even black metal death metal um, electronic stuff you know just basically taking uh, elements from all kinds of, of different genres and blending it with our sound and uh, this diversity you know and uh, also uh, incorporating a lot of dynamics in the arrangements and so on and so on so that you know having a, such a versatile singer that really adds to to our concept you know so uh, um, I really feel that it was a an a enrichment for the band to have uh, Emmanuel as a singer yeah um, I heard <clears throat> I heard uh, Emmanuel singing uh, opera and um, you know I, I heard I saw her, uh, some some recording on YouTube. Um, are you exploiting uh, her uh, voice um, at her maximum? Uh, could you repeat that question, please? I, I'm not sure if I could understand you correctly. Oh, OK. Sorry. Thank you. OK, sorry. Uh, so um, I heard her singing, uh, you know, opera. <clears throat> um, are you exploiting exploiting the uh, the voice of uh, Emmanuel at uh, the, the the maximum capability that she has? Um, well, there's certainly a lot of different um, different things to take from. You know, um, we try yeah. with Serenia not to 
not to overdo uh, the classical parts. Um, we like to put some classical parts in between here and there, um, but more as an addition to the uh, to the modern kind of style that we we usually use. So, uh, but but I'm quite sure she still has a lot of you know unique ways of using her voice that we didn't get around to uh, to use yet. And and for sure we're gonna try to use some of that in the future. Um, yeah. It's just you know trying to to keep uh, a nice balance um, on each album, um, bringing in the, the special kind of techniques and effects more as a, an addition, um, and and trying not to also uh, overdo it. But uh, but for sure, there's um, there's going to be uh, new and different stuff from the band uh, in in the future. You know, both with the music and and with the vocal performances. I'm sure. 